Hi, Patrice. Uh, I'm in the Teaching and Learning Lab at the Harvard Graduate School of Education, and I'd like to share an activity that I think can be helpful this semester when we have a lot of kids, a lot of students who expected to all be together on a residential campus and are now spread out across the globe. And that is um, sharing an aspect of where you are currently living. And the way that I like to present this, um, everyone does not necessarily want to show um, the inside of their home, but you could show like a favorite place to study. Um, you could show a coffee shop that you like to go to. And it could be that you share a picture or you just describe the situation to people. So um, for me, if you look in my background, you will see a lake and a sunset. And that is actually um, from a beach at a place that my family has in Sacandaga Lake, New York in the Adirondacks. And it is my absolute favorite place to go. And I feel very fortunate that I have that space to go to, especially during the current situation that we're in. It's um, a way for me to actually be able to get out of the city and just have some quiet time with family. Autumn, would you like to go next? Uh, sure. Um, I'd probably just show my little workspace area here. I probably won't show it right now because I just got a bunch of packages and there's just a bunch of packages, like empty boxes and packing material that I haven't had a chance to throw out yet. Like, I, seriously, they just came in the mail today. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'd probably just turn my camera around and kind of show my house and like my little work area here. And my house is really messy right now, uh, but I, I can show you two things. Uh, this was the view of, from my window. And so I live like, sorry, got turned off. This was the view from my window. Can you see these flame trees? They have like really orangey flowers um, in the late springtime. And it really cheered me up in the time of COVID when everything was really dreary. And I, I live in a very crowded part of the city. So there is some greenery, but very little compared to what you would find in rainier parts of the world. Uh, so that makes me happy. I also want to show you something a little bit funny. Uh, so beside me, you know how people in, during COVID, especially academics, they put these bookshelves and either they're real or they're virtual backgrounds. So the thing is the biggest bookshelf that shows books in our house, we have, my husband and I are both academics, so we have a lot of books. But the, book, the books that you can see are my kids' books in her room. The, the bookshelf in the living room looks like this. It's got glass covering it. And it's got all my daughter's certificates and her pictures. <laughs> you can't see any of the books behind them. And then all of my husband's books are like these huge medical textbooks and they're hidden inside different parts of this. So you can't see any books there. So I just thought that would be a funny thing to share. Hmm. Uh, what about you, Irene? Um, I, uh, I will not show you my house today because uh, it's not showable. Is there a word like that? <laughs> <laughs> but um, um, at the moment, it's about, it, it's going to 11 in the night in, 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 in Malindi, so it's quite late. I would have gone to show you the balcony where I wake up in the morning and just go and watch the sunrise. And the sunrises here are really, really cool. I don't know if you can see that. A little can you bit. you see that? It, it looks purple. See? Is it? Oh. Oh, no, it's, 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 oh, well, I would have shared it with the, with the, you know, with the share, but it's, it's, they have very beautiful, beautiful sunrises that I, I, I go and watch from, from, from the balcony. So that's my favorite place. I also go and, and, and do my morning uh, gratitude from there. And, and it's, it gives me a lot of, a lot of energy for the day. So that's my favorite place in my house. Uh, because of being uh, at a coastal place, um, there's also very nice uh, wind that blows at that time. So it's quite nice. When you come to visit, I'll show you. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Oh, that was great. Thank you, everyone. And I love I that. I like this activity. I only feel like... What happened, Maha? You're breaking up, Maha. Ma, you broke up. Can't see I'm you. here, but uh, Patrice's voice was cutting out, so I thought it was me, so I turned off my video. Oh. Okay. I, I was just going to say I love that we each kind of took a different approach to sharing something about where we were living, which was, which was great. 
I think at different at different times, if 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 the if if it's a daytime, because then uh, it's it's a totally different time. I think it depends on when the activity is taking place. So I think we are more comfortable sharing where we live during the day. I don't know. I'm more comfortable that way than than at night because at night right. then I mean I'm the house is less up. messy in the morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you've cleaned up, you you know, you're ready for the day. So it's kind of during the day, but at night then you've thrown the the washing on the seats and the shoes are over there and and you didn't expect <laughs> to show it. So yeah. So it's a good yeah. It, it, and but then the I other the really other adaptation cool. I think. Yeah. The other adaptation I would do is just let students know ahead of time, like a couple of days ahead of time, that this is what we're going to be doing. And then they can prepare a clean part of the yes. room, the house, yeah. or, or take a picture and have it on their computer because yeah. sharing it from the phone wasn't so comfortable. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, you. Wait, can, 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 can the students also take up the pictures and then they can upload it onto a Padlet or, or something, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. I think, I think that would be cool. Yeah. yeah? Yeah, I yeah, love yeah, that. Can, yeah. yeah, and then they, they can, can have that canvas. It. It's like yes, a quilt. It can have, be like yes. a quilt of all the yes, different pictures. Yeah, yeah the and then you space. can. I love that. And then you can uh, download it into something that you everybody can have. That would really be cool. Yeah. Mm. Wonderful. Okay. Thank you so yeah. much. That's a great. That's a great uh, riff of that. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, everyone. All right. Yeah. Thank you, everyone. Bye. Yeah.